Happy fall, y'all. Grab your pumpkin for this fun workout at home. It's just 10 minute workout with your pumpkin. And if you don't have a pumpkin, I'm sure you could have a make do one in your home. And let's get going. All right, guys, we're gonna start with the pumpkin squat and press. So you're gonna grab your pumpkin squat and press. Good. Now, if your pumpkin is super heavy, this one's really heavy. Just kidding, it's a smaller pumpkin. Then maybe you won't do as many reps or you'll slow down a little bit, okay? It's also really cold where I am, so I don't mind moving fast right now because it allows me to warm up. Good job. Let's do eight, seven, six. The best part about this is the world is watching me press a pumpkin with you. Three, two, and one. Now you're gonna hold your pumpkin and at the bottom just pull squats up and down. So we're really getting our legs nice and warm, including our quads, our glutes, and our hamstrings. Good, and now we're gonna hold that squat and push out and in with our pumpkin. Good, now some of you, the, again, depending on if you have mini pumpkins, maybe you go faster. If you have a huge pumpkin, maybe you slow down. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. We're gonna take a lunge position, okay? So we're gonna slowly extend our right leg forward and our left leg behind us. From here, we're gonna curl our pumpkin right up to our chest. So we're gonna ignite our biceps. Good, holding your lunge here for eight, seven, six. Make it harder by bending that, that back knee if you want to for three, two, one more time, and one. Bring it into your right hand if available, and we're just gonna single arm press. One, two, good, three, straight up and down. Feel the effort of your legs and your upper body working together, okay, for three, two, and then one. From there, step your feet together, and we're gonna do the other side. So, left leg in front, and then just curl. And lower your back knee if you want to, and curl. Good work. For four, keep curling. Three, good work. Two, we're gonna go back to that single arm variation, and one, bring it into your left hand, and press. Now, if this is too hard, you can use your right hand to assist you, Otherwise, push. Again, make it harder by bending your back knee. For four, it's almost the balance is tough. Three, two, and one. Exhale back to center, okay? And you're just gonna hold your pumpkin in your hand and we're gonna do jacks, out and in. Now, to make it a little bit harder, as you jack out, push up. All right, now if that's too much, you can hold your pumpkin right here. Otherwise, jack and push for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good work. Now we're gonna take a nice wide stance. We're gonna treat our pumpkin like a, a kettlebell, and we're gonna do a deadlift. So we're gonna lower it down and up. So from the side, it's a hinge and a lift. So my back is flat and my butt is going out for eight, seven, chest up, six, five, four, almost there, three, two, and one. From here, we're gonna bring it up and over our head and we're gonna do tr overhead tricep extension. So squat like position, exhale, bend and push. Bend and push. And by the time this is all over, you'll have room for pumpkin pie and you'll have made it, right? Ha ha ha, that is if your pumpkin breaks. Hopefully that doesn't happen. For four, press it up. Three, press it up. Two, press it up. Now we're gonna combine the squat, curl, press. So it's gonna squat, curl, press. Squat, curl, press. Squat, curl, press. Good work. Squat, curl, press, bring it in. Squat, curl, press, bring it in. Squat, curl, press. Three more. Squat, curl, press. Squat, curl, press. Last one, squat, curl, press, and in. Now we're gonna combine the curl with the overhead tricep. So hold your squat. So you're gonna curl, bring it up, overhead tricep extension, bring it down, release. Curl, press, overhead, up and down, release. Curl, press, tricep, lift, down. Four more. So it's curl, push, one, 
down, release, good. Curl, press, tricep, overhead, down, two. Last two, curl, push, overhead, tricep. Last one, come on, curl, push, overhead, and done. Good work. Now, holding your pumpkin, front lunges. So step, bring it together, step, bring it together. So from the side, it's the same concept as a lunge, okay? So you're just going forward, together, forward, together, forward, feet together. If this is too hard, you could also just do a split squat. So you're just lunging in place and then switching legs, okay? Otherwise, let's step and step and step. Eight more total, okay? So we're going eight together, seven together, six together, five, four, three, two, one more time, and one. Good job. Let's widen our stance. We're gonna hold our pumpkin nice and low. Try to touch the ground and then drive it up. Tap and up. So when you do these wide-legged squats, make sure you keep your knees in line with your middle toes. So don't allow them to fall in. Good work. Let's do eight. Squeeze your butt at the top. Seven. Good. Six. Exhale as you come up. So inhale, exhale, press away. Inhale, lower, exhale, press away. Last four, last three. Get that pumpkin to the ground for two. One more time, and one. Good work, we're gonna have a seat with our pumpkin, okay? So you can use a mat if you want, or you don't have to, it's totally up to you. Pick up your feet and we're gonna twist side to side with our pumpkin, so left and right. So lift your chest forward, and then just rotate through this. So feel the work. You're over halfway through your pumpkin workout, so stay with it. To make it harder, let's go overhead. Overhead, good, so like a rainbow. For four, three, side to side, and two. One more time, right, one more time left, and hold your pumpkin. Now we're gonna go back to that single arm work, okay? So if this is too hard, you're gonna use the fingertips on the left hand and then assist you up and down as we press our pumpkin. For eight, seven, squeeze your knees, six, Five, good work. Four, three, we're almost there guys. Two, and let's switch hands, okay? So the other side, we're gonna put it in our palm. And again, maybe this is your tough side so you can use your two fingers for support. Maybe you have to use your whole hand depending on how large of a pumpkin you picked. For eight, seven, six, you got this. Five, if your back is hurting, just put those feet down. Four, three, two, one more time, and one. Good work. Now we're gonna take our pumpkin and place it on our mat. Now if your pumpkin has any poop on it, be careful. I know sometimes we pick our pumpkins a little too early in the season. So from here, I'm gonna lower my chest down until it touches the pumpkin. So I'm gonna go down and up. From there, I'm gonna pick up my pumpkin, put it to the side, down and up. Grab my pumpkin, bring it back to center, touch my chest down to it, release. You my outside hand, bring it over this side. Push up and up, good. We're gonna bring it back to center. Bring it down and up. Bring it out to the side, down and up. Bring it back to center, one more time in center, okay? Down and up. One more time out to the side. We're going down and up, and then exhale, release that. Good work. We're gonna turn our pumpkin into a little bit of core, and then you're done. Now, maybe you do this workout two or three times through, you get a nice 30 minute workout. Otherwise, sit up. Good, we got about two minutes. Done. Not just Good. Push that pumpkin. Starting to add some resistance. Up and down. Let's go eight, seven, Five, four, you're almost there. Three, two, one more time. Head as we lower our back. Depending on the weight of the five. Three, almost there. Three, 
super strong. Good, pumpkin strong. All the way through. And one. Now, this finisher, if you can, you're gonna use assistance or you might be able to do this by yourself, okay? It's definitely challenging. So we're gonna place our pumpkin on our back and we're gonna finish with a pumpkin plank. So I'm gonna put it right here on my lower back, extend one leg back, find my balance. Ah! That didn't. <laughs> That's a really big hill. And my pumpkin is gone. So let's do a plank without the pumpkin. <laughs> 10 seconds. Hold here for five, four, three, two, and one. Good work, guys. That wasn't supposed to happen, so that's a real life blooper for you ending your workout. Awesome job, repeat it if you can. Stay strong this fall season.